you're thinking about moving to Kailua, Kona, Hawaii, I'm going to give you six reasons why you're going to hate it here. Welcome back. I'm Stephen Porosky with Real Estate Kailua Kona and Corkin Pacific Properties. And this is where we will discuss everything you need to know about moving to the Kona area. Be sure to stick around for my list of six things why you're not going to like it here. Weather. If you like the change of seasons, seeing the leaves turn colors in the fall, snow in the winter, then moving to Kailua Kona is not going to be for you. We live on a tropical island where our year-round temperatures average between 75 and 85 degrees. Not many people know this, but we have eight ecosystems on the island. From wet tropical rainforest, dry arid plains, and yes, even snow-covered mountainous areas at the Mauna Kea summit. If you like wearing shorts and flip-flops on a daily basis, this could be your new home. Shopping. If you are a shopaholic and like going to the malls on a regular basis, then moving to the Kona, Hawaii area is not going to be for you. There are no big shopping malls here in Kona like you would see on the mainland. We do have a Macy's, a few national chains like Ross, Old Navy, Target, and a lot of small boutiques. If you want to shop at the high-end department stores, then you're just a short plane ride away from Honolulu, where you can get your fix of shopping at some of the country's best stores, like Nordstrom, Bloomingdale, Neiman Marcus, and even Saks Fifth Avenue. Yes, island hopping is very popular here and inexpensive as well. Entertainment. If you like going out to nightclubs, live shows, and major sporting events, then moving to Kailua Kona is not going to be for you. Kona is a small town with a population of around 37,000 people and offers a laid-back island vibe. Yes, we have a good selection of bars and restaurants, but after that, there's no concert venues, no major sporting teams to watch live, and no live shows or concerts. The majority of people here find their entertainment at the ocean, swimming, snorkeling, fishing, boating, etc. Again, if you're looking for a cosmopolitan lifestyle, you can always head over to Honolulu and enjoy the nightlife and entertainment scene there. Restaurants. If you're a foodie and love to go out trying different cuisines every night of the week, then Kailua Kona is not going to be a great place for you. We do have a good variety of restaurants here in Kona, and some of my favorites are Hugo's and Jackie Ray's. If you love fresh fish, then this is the place to be. We have outstanding poke bars all around, and living by the ocean, fishermen bring in their catch daily, and you can find fresh fish being served at all the restaurants. Not to mention, we have pop-up fish stands around the area as well. If one doesn't mind the drive, you can find some great dining experience at some of our world-famous resorts, like the Four Seasons at Hulu Alilai, the Fairmont Orchid, and even Manolani, just to name a few. Employment. If you're looking for great employment opportunities, then Kailua Kona may not be your destination location. We don't have any major employers on the island like a Microsoft or an Amazon. The majority of employment opportunities here are in the hospitality industry, working at the resorts and the restaurants, along with opportunities in the construction labor industry. Since the pandemic, we have seen a good number of people move to the island who are able to work remotely and this has opened the door to a sizable number of people who now call Kailua Kona home. Affordable housing. If you're looking for affordable housing and apartment rentals, Kailua Kona may not be a great place for you. Hawaii is one of the most expensive housing markets in the United States. Our medium home sales price here in Kona is $861,000 and our median condo sales price is $515,000. We live in a destination location and these prices are continuing to climb year over year. The average two bed, two bath condo apartment rents between $1,800 and $2,200 a month if you can even find a place. There are very few if any apartment complexes in the Kailua Kona area and a large majority of condo owners rent their units using Airbnb and VRBO for short-term vacation rentals. 
If you do decide to make Kailua Kona your home, start your home search months in advance of moving here so you will have a place to stay. Be prepared for competition with your housing choices since our inventory is low and our demand is high. Why? Because people want to live and play in Hawaii, don't you? If you want additional information about moving to Kailua Kona, hit the button below and ask for our free relocation guide and subscribe to our channel as well. Mahalo.